Hello, everyone. Um, we are Teleria Technologies, and we're looking forward to stepping into a new era of digital healthcare. So I am Pedro Regalado, the founder and CEO of Teleria Technologies, and we also have our technical advisors, Dr. Chen Chen and Dr. Tao Han, and our CFO, Scott Christensen. So how did we get here? We first started by researching different mixed reality technologies and solutions. We combined this with different edge computing researchers to see how we can be as low cost as possible, as well as different wireless systems, as that's where our society is heading as well. But we all know that an idea is only an idea until we put a step forward. So we applied to the NSF Venture Fires Regional i program, and we got accepted. Through this program, we were able to do over 30 plus interviews interviewing different people in healthcare, manufacturing, sports, and education sectors to see where mixed reality could best um, put its foot forward. We were also able to do a business model canvas focusing on value propositions as well as customer segments to see what Teleria could offer and who our audience was. Then after this program, we took a step forward and also applied to NSF Venture Prize National i program and through a rigorous interview process, we were also selected. And through this program, we were able to achieve over 100 plus interviews, now focusing specifically on healthcare sector to see where our niche was for our mixed reality solution. So some of the disadvantages in healthcare that we found through our interviews were that there were inefficient garment wearing tactics, such as especially in the ICU units where nurses are going in, putting in their garments, taking care of patients, coming back out, taking their garments off and taking notes and then going back in, et cetera. And it becomes a repetitive and inefficient task. We also found redundant note taking where nurses are just charting all day long or just taking notes. And even if the desktop or computer is in, the same room as the patient, sometimes the nurse is with their back to the patient, which decreases customer satisfaction and makes the patient feel unheard. Finally, there were burnouts. An average of, there's an average of 13 hours that nurses work per shift. And so this creates a lot of stress in their work when they're doing different things. So if you're still unconvinced, why Teleria? We want to change the current digital healthcare. We want to remove the screen barrier. We don't want there to be phones, desktops, or computers anymore. We want everything to be right in front of your eyes. We focus on providing extreme safety by validating patient information with our facial recognition algorithms and doing uh, verifying patient medication to see if it's correct. Um, we save nurses a lot of redundancy in note keeping and we improve customer satisfaction. We boost productivity and prevent different burnouts as burnouts we all know can be a safety hazard as well when doing things and can cause more damage in the medical field. Finally, we allowed global collaboration so that with one button away, I can contact any other nurse or doctor in the world. And this is beneficial even post pandemic. So what are our current needs today? We want to become OSHA compliant so that we can work with different uh, clinics and hospitals. We want to partner for different key testing and parameters. We want to revise our cost structure of expenses so not only we can survive, but we can also thrive in our company. We want to shift from the prototype and minimal viable, pro minimum viable product to a full production phase. And we want to get key funding for marketing and sales. So through the Venture Price Launch 2.0, we want to revise and update our cost structure, our key partners and resources, and get our revenue streams correct. We want to boost our marketing efforts. We want to take advantage of the mentorship, do pilot studies with different uh, clinics and hospitals. And finally, we want to conduct surveys to make sure that not only the nurse is content, but also the patient as well. Thank you.